Perfect. Uh, Megan, first, thank you for taking a little time to talk about the series. Uh, I love what I've seen so far and congratulations on it. Thank you so much. Thank you. I'm excited to be talking to you. We don't got a lot of time. We've got a lot to dive into. I, I went ahead and read the, the novel uh, before coming into the series and obviously the interview. So I want to ask, obviously, we know this is a, a work of fiction, but the characters, to me, simply real. So mm -hmm. I wonder uh, what from the characters, uh, how the, the characters were uh, constructed and told came from the story and or what was created for the series? Came from the story from the book? Yep. And what was created for the series? I think in terms of the ensemble characters outside of Lucy and Steven, they were so small in the book that we really got to create those from scratch, for, more or less, um, and, you know, find all new things for them because the book was so focused just on Lucy and Steven. Mm -hmm. And I think Lucy and Steven are definitely, I think, emotionally very truthful to the characters in the book. But all of us in the writer's room pulled a lot from our real lives and our own experiences to just flesh these characters out. And then the series is so multi-layer because of the characters. I think the characters is the key to the series, what makes it so good. Um, for the audience that didn't read, didn't read the book, they're not so caught up on Lucy and, and Stephen, um, what, 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 had to, what do you have to change in order to captivate that audience to drive them from the book to the series or from the book to the series? Well, I think casting is number one. You know, if you have the right actors in the roles and they're, they're people that you can't stop watching, then you've done 90% of your work for you. And I think it's just about keeping the writing sharp and intentional and never wasting time. I really try not to, even though there is a lot of silence and there are pauses, I, I try to make sure that they're all for a purpose um, so that people don't get bored because nowadays people have no attention span. Um, yeah. Um, I, I want to talk about come, you know, bringing the series to the stream flap, right? I think it, it gave the series a little more space, a little more liberty to do certain stuff that you wouldn't be able to do if you put it on a, on a traditional uh, cable channel. Um, how, how were you? Uh, and I saw that obviously coming from the book uh, and being so sexy and so open, how much were you able to push those limits? Well, Hulu is wonderful and they are, for them, it's go as far as you need to, to tell the story as long as it's not gratuitous. And so there is a lot of sex in the show, but it's never just for the point of having a sex mm -hmm. scene. You know, some of the sex is sexy. Some of it's really sad. Some of it's really awkward. Some of it's embarrassing. Um, and so, yeah, we definitely were able to push a lot of limits, but then we would also pull things back when we felt like we were going too far. It was just more than we needed to to do. And we also spoke to our actors, you mm -hmm. know, there was, um, they were always very, very involved in, in all the sex scenes and no one did anything that they did not want to do. And there were times when a couple of actors would be like, you know, I don't think we actually need the sex scene. And I was like, great, we don't need it, you know? So, yeah. I think I don't know if I have one, a time one more question, but I think a lot of people can relate to the character. I think the character is the reason strong suit of the series. All the characters are built so well. Um, for people that are, are you know that 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 are completely blind coming into the series just by seeing the trailer, they're just seeing one side of the story. What can they expect from it? They will see more sides of the story for sure. They will. the The trailer is definitely mostly from Lucy's point of view. Mm -hmm. We will absolutely learn about Steven's emotional internal life, his family, his backstory, but also all of the ensemble characters. We will get to dive into their secrets uh, as well. Mm -hmm. Yep, that's completely why I absolutely love what I saw so far. Um, again, again, thank you for your time to talk about the series and congratulations. I absolutely love what, what I've seen so far. Um, thank you so much. That really means so much to me. People don't relate to it. I know, not much. I know they're going to love it. Thank you. Thank you.